Hello, welcome to another Rust tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to configure a laser detector to open a garage door and also disable a SAM turret. This is designed to be used in a minicopter base so when you fly out with your minicopter you trip the laser, it opens the door, disables your SAM turret, yeah, you can fly off, do whatever you need to do, when you come back you land you wheel your minicopter back inside, it trips the laser, shuts the door and reactivates the SAM turret. For this build we're going to need power source which I'm just using the generator, it's not in the main game yet but it's just easier for demonstration purposes. A splitter, a memory cell, a laser detector and the siren light. The siren light is optional but I like to use it because it gives a visual cue as to when the SAM turret is activated or not and you can see it from quite a distance. Okay let's get started. First thing we want to do is we want to run power from our power source into our splitter and then we run power from our splitter into our memory cell. We also run power to our laser detector and power out from our laser detector runs back into toggle on our memory cell. Now the right hand output of the memory cell runs to our door controller and the left hand output, the inverted output, runs to our siren light. pass through goes straight into our SAM turret and that is pretty much set up. You can see the SAM turret is currently activated and the siren light is doing its thing. So as you can see currently our SAM turret is active and our siren light is flashing but if we no clip into the building and trigger the laser It's opened the garage door, it's deactivated the turret and it's turned off our siren light and then obviously you would fly back, you would land your minicopter, wheel it in, trip the laser and there you go, an active SAM turret and a closed garage door. Thanks for watching guys, see you next time.